in today's lesson, we're going to show you how to self-check your pronunciation. Uh, this is the third method. Please look at the videos on, on the other two ways to check uh, very quickly and simply whether you are pronouncing the words correctly. To download Audacity, the app to check your pronunciation is below, but there are many other free apps that you can download. Once you've downloaded and installed them, then they're easy to run. You just on an Apple Mac, you use the Finder to run the app. Now we're going to show you how to check your pronunciation using an audio waveform, which is very, very simple. So I suggest you download something like um, Audacity. Audacity. And this app allows you to speak and then check what the sound looks like. In English, if, you, if people are having trouble understanding your pronunciation, your UK English pronunciation, you'll see them frowning at you, saying, sorry, sorry, what was that? And they say, oh, can you repeat that? Could you repeat what you had to say? Quite often this can be because you are not pronouncing consonants on the ends of words, particularly D, D, or T, T. If you omit these consonants, people can struggle to understand you. And in an exam situation, for example, the Cambridge speaking exam, that can uh, cause a, a big problem. If you have Audacity open, let's practice with this word here. The correct pronunciation is Microsoft, with a very clear T sound. So let's self-check to see if we're doing that properly. Microsoft. Now you can see here, Microsoft. There's a very clear T sound showing on the waveform. Now, if you omit that, it looks very, very different. Microsoft. See, Microsoft, there's no T sound here. Let me show you the two waveforms next to each other. So this is without the T, and this is with the T. Now if we line them up, Microsoft, Microsoft. So do download Audacity, which is very good because it, it's free and it works on Apple Macs, Windows and Linux but there are plenty other free audio waveform applications that you can use to check and make sure that your pronunciation is perfectly good. What are the words that are most difficult to pronounce correctly in your language? Please write in the comments below and I'll see if I can make some videos to show you how to pronounce those words correctly in UK English. And of course, it will vary from one language to another. So please write in those comments, which, which words do you find the most difficult to pronounce in UK English?